Betty, I guess we can uh, get started. Fun fact, the line, play it against Sam, does not actually appear in Casablanca. Hmm. Oh, are we starting? Um, I'm just clicking in to make sure it works, and it does. So, whenever you're set. <clears throat> I'm on that New Junk City screen. Okay, as am I, so I guess we'll just get started. It's not like it's a race or anything. Not that it's a... Yeah, I was going to say. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Uh, start with map bar. That's alright, so did the title screen. <laughs> ah... I forgot about his southern accent, he'll, he'll learn that. Oh, it's... Dang it. There we go, cow launched. I actually forgot how to play this game. There we go. Alright, cow launched. Ah. I also forgot about how jamming this jam track is. Holy crap. See, it's funny because the thing I always remember about Earthworm Jim is the. Mm, is the uh, public domain music they use. Oh, really? Yeah. I actually did not know they used public domain music. There. <laughs> Oh, what the... in tarnation? Ah, oh, tarnation! Oh! Ah, yeah, I found the toilet warp. Wow, those graphics are bad. <laughs> Alright, I hit the continue point. Warning! I got... sort of boss thing. Something that really kind of threw me off watching the HD version of this game. They actually, like, list the boss's health at the bottom of the screen or something. Oh, really? It's weird. Ow. 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 Oh, I am getting my butt kicked! Ow. Oh, I can't... okay. Yeah, very long invincibility frames. Yeah, but like, holy crap, the gameplay is terrible. Yeah. Like, have you played this NES version of- I assume you have. Oh yeah. Yeah, so- so how much worse is this version? Oh, it's way worse. <laughs> like, I love my Game Boy Advance. Yeah. But... Battle. Funny thing is, there's a Game Boy Color version of Earthworm Jim as well. What? <laughs> yeah, Seriously. and uh, I don't know how well it plays, mind. Uh, 
It looks like it plays at least no worse than this one. Uh, Possibly yeah. better. Well, I would be interested in checking that out for sure. Maybe we should do that. Yeah, I intend to get that eventually. Groovy! Groovy. Alright, let's beat the first stage. Oh yeah. Nice. Oh god, the anti asteroid stage is not gonna look good. This looks theoretically okay, but like compared to the uh, original, it's not. Oh, I'm bad. I'm bad. <laughs> A bad. Cobalt says, reminder, the boss is tires in a trash can that drops tubas on you. Yep. Very cool. Well, that, the mid-boss is a, is a trash can with tires for limbs that shoots uh, anvils at you. The actual first boss uh, at the end of that stage is some, like, I don't know, trucker guy or something up on a, like, seat, pulling a lever that drops boxes and tubas at you. Yeah, I'm there right now. Which is pretty good. Okay, so... This version of Andy Asteroids looks like Andy Ass, but, um... It, it's easier by a lot. <laughs> <laughs> Interesting. He vomits, uh... No, not anvils. He vomits fish. Go on. Funny thing is that some, a lot of these, like, sound bites for the voices don't actually sound all that much worse, if at all. Because the originals were so heavily, like, sound crushed. This is the stage I always remember. Um, I just didn't read the name of it, but it's when you're in heck. And the cat, the evil, like, Satan cat is there. And it's playing, um, Night on Bald Mountain. Ah, uh, yeah. I remember that now. Yeah, I think his name's Evil the Cat. It might be. This, the Earthworm Jim's fantastic like that. Groovy! We, like, so deserve another Earthworm Jim game. Yes. We need more comedy games that are just, like, silly all over. Wow, I, I think I prefer... I think I prefer Iridian 3D's graphics over the quote-unquote 3D that we get here. Oh, like I said, the, <laughs> yeah, this version of Andy Asteroids looks really crap. <laughs> this is garbage. <laughs> yeah, like, that looks... It is funny, because I did not... I had only, like, barely touched the game before. Um, so I didn't really... I just kind of knew it, it didn't feel good to play. But I didn't really know, like, how it looked exactly. And then I sucked at the game. Um... But so I didn't realize, like, just how bad it looked in some places until I saw the, the toilet warp earlier. <laughs> oh, what the crap, game. Game! So what do the bubbles do? Uh, um... Uh... They bubble. Oh, okay. That I don't sense. know. I, I, I really genuinely don't remember what the bubbles are supposed to do. Did I just go... I did. I, I, I dumb. I are dumbed it up. I just got a... I just got a very sad Seinfeld. That... Seinfeld? Yes. I... I... I don't know. Yeah, it's... it's... it's some sort of not good thing. Oh, there we go. So I'm now battling Psycho. 
What? You shouldn't be. You just beat him to the- Oh! You didn't beat him to the end of the anti-asteroids. Yeah. If you beat him to the end of it, you just win. Ah, go flargle blargle. Hargle majargle dargle. I don't remember this fight. Uh. Ah! Oh, evil snowman in heck! Am I... Are my bullets bulleting him? Okay, I don't think so. I think I whip him. Whip it good. When a snowman comes along, you must whip it. Yeah, I'm not sure if I'm doing any damage against this guy either. I don't even know. I haven't hit on that fight in so long. I don't long. know what is happening. I forgot I have a whip. <laughs> oh my god, this is just like... Wow. <laughs> this is bad. Yeah. I want to go is, to the game um, store tomorrow and actually get a copy, a copy of the, the SNES version of Earthworm Jim. Oh, <laughs> Just so I can get the taste out of my mouth. <clears throat> and mind you, I don't even know how the original plays. I can only assume that it plays it's better, better than, than this. this. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. I can tell you right now for sure. It plays better. It looks better. There we go. That's how it smells you. better. Now I understand. <laughs> Ow! Like I said, the sound bites were well preserved, though. Yeah. Somehow. Considering all the crap people give the GBA for its sound chip. Yeah, it's really nowhere as bad as anyone thinks it is. Oh, yeah, it's not even close. Oops, and I'm bad. Oh, bye, crystals. Hope I didn't soft lock. Oh, good, they came back. Okay, so I just finally figured out how to deal with Psycho. Oh, good. Ruby! What the heck? You know what else got a lot of crap it really didn't deserve? Oh my god, that unfinished background, like, terrain sprite. That's... I, I don't... I don't know. Anyway, um... Earthworm Jim 3D got way more crap than it deserved. Like, it wasn't... You know, I'm not gonna claim it was actually, like, super amazing and totally as good as Banjo-Kazooie or something, but... That game got way more crap than it deserved. Right. Okay, so yeah, this is this is where I got stuck. In my casual playthrough. Okay. From the previous I'm playthrough. on... The boss? I think? I, it only just occurred to me that, like, Night on Bald Mountain has stopped playing a long time ago. <laughs> yeah. Just changed for me, too. So I don't actually understand where to go. Uh, you kind of, like, honestly, it's a pretty much, it's more or less a straight line. Um, the one thing, and it actually screwed me up just now, you'll get to your first green rotating crystal -y thing. If you stand on them, they kind of make you fall off to the left. You have to walk to the right on top of them, and it'll start them spinning. And um, the very first one you find, it, as you start to spin it by walking to the right, it'll rise up. I just found keep, it like just moves. keep going. Don't jump off of it. Just keep going until it makes you run off of it. Okay. Because uh, I jumped off it early, and like that really screwed me up. Gotcha. <clears throat> yeah, that's funny. It does a little record scratch and it stops playing it. Okay, I'm definitely on like actual boss fight. Nice. Okay, here. Taking out all nine lives of, of evil cat boy, man, dude. 
I just caught myself holding L to shoot diagonally. <laughs> nope, not in this game. Also, the, the like voice clips that are in the game don't sound too bad, but there's a bunch of voice clips that are just not in the game. Oh, wow. Like when you fight, th this part of the fight where you take out all nine of his lives, in the original there was a voice that counted each death, so, you know, mm -hmm. you know nine, three, or, you know, eight, seven, six, all the way down until you took out the last life. Okay, just cleared past the crystal. Thank you for the tip. Mm-hmm. And now I am on to down the tubes. Oh god, this stage. This is gonna be... If you got, if you got, um, stuck on that stage, oh boy. You're gonna love down the tubes. Uh, well, how do I get past this, uh, golden grate thing here? Uh, there's a gear kind of in the terrain behind you. Gotcha. Uh, whip it. Don't sh shooting it won't do anything. Just whip it. Whip it good. Whip it good. I will say that this isn't the worst thing I've ever played. Oh, it's... It, I mean, it's not good, but it's not terrible. It's just... It's it's definitely a, a shadow of, like, the actual original. Yeah. Eh, I mean, that's that's being a bit harsh. It's just... It's not a good port. That's really all it is. It's just, it's just not a particularly good port. Yeah. <clears throat> and even then, it's... Again, it's playable. Yeah, exactly. Yippee! Yeah, the music is pretty top notch. Oh, it gets cut teleported, okay. Wow. Ow! Grab those. Let me ride the hamster! And bad timing. That was great. Ride that giant hamster. And then get thrown off of it. Ah! Oh, good! This part. This is the part of Down the Tubes that sucks really bad. There's a an underwater segment where you have to momentum control a uh, like a bathysphere kind of thing. I see. And it's not good. It wasn't even particularly good in the original, and it's on a timer. Delightful. Yeah. Heck, I'm about to actually fail it. Oh, oh, the seconds with only four seconds on the clock. I made it. Yeah, yeah. Checkpoint! Nice. Hmm. Was that where I wanted to go? Let's hear it for video games, everybody. <laughs> wow. Wow. Yeah, I'm gonna have to do a little bit of catching up here. Hey, it, it, it'll be the first time I've ever uh, finished a game first. <laughs> That's true. During any of these streams. It's one of those things where I'm just kind of like, you fucking challenge you to Mega Man. Right. I actually don't know if you like play Mega Man or anything. So. No, I think it if you ever seem did like a, a Mega Man stream, you'd probably have the upper hand. Oh, that's bad. That's a bad. Where am I going, game? Same, though. 
Like I said, in Heck, you, you in that level, you really can't actually go the wrong way. You can kind of just end up running a loop in some situations. But always look for, like, the green crystal and just... <gasps> and I died. Thanks, game. That was totally fair. Um, Anytime you see crystals, you, like, you have to use them. There's no fake-out crystals or anything. Well, that's good. Wow. Wow. Oh, I am now just the worm. Okay. So I have absolutely no idea what to do. For a sec. And there's some parts that are kind of platformy, like you just gotta look around for that ledge above you that you can grab. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> and just keep climbing. So for this part where I'm out of the suit, um, do I just survive? Oh, yeah, yeah, you just survived that part. That seems kind of... strange. It's, it's Earthworm Jim. It's, it's all about random, you know? Yeah, okay, there it goes. Shit. Oh my god. Going this way? Nope. Where am I going? Oh, is this the first one? No, no. The... Okay, how do I not get not get evil catted? <laughs> I, I assume you're at the part where he's like attacking you as kind of a a specter. Yeah. I mostly just stand in the middle. And react when you see him coming in. You sh you can shoot him faster than he can hit you if you uh, react fast enough. Gotcha. Um, and the game just fucked me over again. Um, and then every time you hit him and take out a life, some fire will come across the ground uh, from the left and then from the right. So. Gotcha. <sighs> So going that way is literally meaningless. Well, to start. I love how the suit just drags them off screen, though. Well, I think it was supposed to be that he dragged the suit. Oh, I see. Alright, it says nine. Oh, yep, that's the part I was referring to. Nine hecked. Oh, don't get hacked. Eight. Okay. I can deal with this. <laughs> Seven. Six. Five. Yeah, standing in the middle is a good strategy. Funny how bosses can go from ridiculously hard to ridiculously easy. You just know yeah. what to do. Hacked again. Where am I? My stock sound effects once again. Alright, one more hit. I actually have like a oh, pretty big oh, yeah. love for stock sound effects. Yeah, me too. So I was like, hey, there's so. that scream, or hey, there's that meow. Yeah. Hey, here's, there's that cartoon plunge again. Yeah. As like an old anime fan, like there's a lot of old <laughs> sound effects right. from those that I absolutely adore to death. Oh, so I have to actually shoot this guy. Did I? Oh no. Alright, how do I deal with Tube Guy? Uh, the, the big beefy cats? Yeah, I guess. Uh, you need to go into the. Ah! Oh, it was right there! Oh, 
Uh, go to the tube behind them as they're walking away from you, and you'll notice that there's, like, a bump in the ceiling of the tube. Uh, jump into it and hold up. And you'll, you'll, like, grab onto a thing, and then he'll pull his butt up in the air. Ah, uh, I see. And the cat will then walk under you. At this rate, you're gonna catch up, unless you get really stuck on the bathysphere. I think I might. Okay, here we try again. Uh, okay. screen timer for when they walk off screen and immediately respawn or something. Oh, yeah. No. As far as I can tell, areas all kind of exist constantly. Yeah. <clears throat> Don't. Don't screw it up. Do it. I yes. Okay. Oh, hello, giant. <sighs> Got through the second bathysphere segment. Okay. So yeah, I guess there's just a, a giant hamster now. <laughs> I mean, fr friggin' Earthworm Jim, you know. That's that's what Earthworm Jim did. They did crazy like. Trippy. Yeah. I must say I am quite a fan. Huh. How do I? Can I? No. Do you just? Okay. That's weird. Oh, I could have, like, thinged the thing right there, and it would have been glorious. Alright, how do I deal with the, um... <laughs> the orange cat dudes without a blaster? Uh... You shouldn't... need to. Oh boy. Third bathysphere segment. It is filling oh, my see. timer. I just jumped on top of the hamster. We're good. Oh, yeah. Okay. I thought you already like figured that part out. Yeah, the, you can bite all on the hamster and he'll just chomp them. Gotcha. Okay. Here we go. My bathysphere timer has been... Cr was cranked up to 99. And so now it's uh, the... What I'm pretty sure is the final bathysphere segment. Oh, please don't die. Please only have to do this once. Ugh. I don't understand how to navigate this. I like the rest of it, there's really only one way to go. They'll they'll kind of give you a, a couple fakes in the second bathysphere segment, but one of them is like you get a gun power up, but they also give you air tubes. You'll see them sticking out of walls that you can gotcha. attach the bathysphere to to get some time back. 
makes sense. Ugh. Heck. Ow! <laughs> it's the it's this one where you get ninety nine seconds and you know that means there's no other. <laughs> you know. Oh, don't do that. Yeah. There's no other air that's gonna be given to you. You've just gotta. Oh, I'm right there! Don't screw it! Don't screw it! But I actually got there with like 15 seconds to spare, so... On the first try. So, like, I don't think it's super difficult or anything. Fair enough. What a great boss fight. Does he... What? Oh, that is lame beyond lame. He doesn't eat Bob the Goldfish. Mm. Oh, you can crack this thing. Yeah, yeah. And be careful, because if you, like, touch a, a, a... Like, a, if you wedge into a corner, oh, it'll yeah. just completely shatter it immediately, and you're just screwed. I should note, when you're doing the anti-asteroid segments, there's things that kind of blend into the asteroids, but they're actually like warp whole things, touch those, they're boosts. One second to spare. <laughs> <clears throat> Sorry to interrupt, but, uh, yeah. Oh no, that's... That's close. <laughs> Alright, we're out of there. Whoosh. Woo, baby! Well, Carrie, I can't think of a single game where I've hated an underwater stage because they're not actually that bad. People just whine about them and turn it into a pop culture thing to hate them. <laughs> no, I don't care how many times you had to do the uh, water temple in Ocarina of Time. It's not a problem, round one. This. This part. Oh boy. I was always really bad at this part. Oh, okay, I can fly. I love that it's the, it's somehow a bungee jumping battle against a, a giant sentient snob. We're going up. We are going Beat all em. the way to 99. Here we go. Ooh, not like <clears throat> it's not a problem. Round two! Dun, dun. Oh, that was not good. But fine. Not good, not good, not good. No. You get away from me, sir. Oh, oh my gosh, this game is cheating now. Whoa! Oh my gosh. That wall! I hit it too. That's not good. I wish, I wish more games like this existed. The world deserves more of this. <laughs> <laughs> Don't you even dare, man. 
No! Stop daring, game. Ugh! Stop it! I feel like the game should not even dare. It shouldn't. Not even slightly. Got him! Okay. Nope, nope, nope. Okay. It's not a problem. Round three! And I don't know why you get, like, a stage name every time. <laughs> oh, hello, Bob. Oops. No. No. Bad, bad. Yes, go to that side. Don't get eaten. Go to this side. Good boss fight. Hit him into the wall! Oh yeah, the Bob the Goldfish. I love it. Yeah. It's sad though. In the original version, uh, he eats him. Oh man. He just you just walk up to the goldfish bowl and Jim just pulls gold Bob the Goldfish out and eats him. Oh, I'm disappointed then. Yeah. I'm definitely gonna get a cartridge of this. Oh, de oh man. Like the the real one. <laughs> I love level five is literally just called level five. <laughs> Yeah, no, the Earthworm Gym is a fantastic experience of a game. They're not, they're by no means, like, the pinnacle of gaming. Like, they never were, they never did anything in terms of gra they knew what they were. graphical fidelity or soundtrack or really just anything that was, like, not already capable of or done or whatever. But they're just so much fun. There's personality yeah. just oozing. This is when you care more about the you know, the content, the experience. Would you Get on that platform, though? Uh... What am I... What am I not doing here? What am I doing incorrectly? <laughs> Do I not? Oh, there we go! Groovy! Maybe. It's not a problem, but... round one. Okay, now I'm, like, not sure what I'm doing. <laughs> And I died. I, I fell down a pit. My suit blew up. Continue, yes. Oh, crap. So there is finite lives, or finite continues. That oh, yeah. is troubling. That's a little troubling. Especially since I don't remember, like, okay. how long the game actually is. Mm. It's not a, it's not a long game, granted, but... Are you f fiddling my faddle? <laughs> Is that seriously what I had to do, was do that and then get, come back here and do that? I mean, that's not like... I don't know. It's not rocket science or something, but... I feel like that wasn't made as abundantly clear as it should have been. I like oh, these I like this uh, I like this boss fight, the bungee. Oh the it's not a problem. Yeah. This is clever. Ha 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 game why? Just let me do the thing. Okay. I just got hecked. There we go. Okay, now I can go up here. Which can get me up here. Which can ow. Ooh, quick kill. Yeah. <laughs> I just ended him before oh, he yeah. reached the end of the rope the first time. Oh, 
Harvey. Level five. I am level five. Not sure what to do. Go this way, maybe. Oh, you game you! Don't do that. That's it. I'm pulling that up. Oh heck. Okay, so if you fall down, you. I die. will fiddle your faddle game. I'll do it. Oh, I'm on my last continue. Oh this really? Is a problem. I get your push. <laughs> come on, come on. Let me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There we go. Ah, brains. Ooh, checkpoint. Nice. Okay. And now for a hey, you can shoot in eight cardinal directions. So we've built a challenger based around that. <laughs> Tell what's a platform or what isn't. <laughs> yeah, this stage is um pretty wonky for that. I'll say. Oh, that's death. Okay. Oh, they toned that way the heck down on the Game Boy Advance. What? Uh-oh. What else did they nerf? Oh. So that whole, like, oh, you know, we built a challenge around the fact that you can shoot in the eight cardinal directions thing. Mm -hmm. They only come from three directions ever. Oh, man. That's a cheap out. Oh, I am definitely picking up the SNES version. I want my full gym experience. Ah, Dr. Monkey for a head. Get back here. Oh, yeah, he's a thing, isn't he? Yep. <laughs> I'm whipping the crap out of him right now. And he's releasing flying eyeballs at me. No, he's a jerk. In the anime, which I've chosen to call it. I got to say, that's um, a weird decision you've made. Uh, he was actually the, like, the villain. Like, one of, if not the worst of the entire series. Game, 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 don't do it! How do I... Don't... Don't you do it, game, game! Game! Okay, okay. The real talk, though, whipping the, like, whip points to swing somewhere, that was always pretty wonky. Oh, uh, yeah. Game! Game! I'm gonna need you to, like, scooby dooby don't Frick! I thought you were gonna catch up because of the bathysphere thing, and I mean, you kinda did, but. This! Holy smeg! Why does he keep. doing that? Smeg? That was my fault. My, that wasn't my fault. So yeah, this is a game. Um. 
Say what? So yeah, this is a game. <laughs> game, 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 game. My professional opinion is that this is indeed a game. Oh, finally! What have you done? I, I got... I swung from a platform to another platform! What? I know, right? It's madness. See, at this point, I'm just concerned about running out of lives. I I still can't figure out where to go from the uh, the little... Like, the whole thing with the jumping on the black balls. Oh, okay, so, well, did you... You got to a point, and there was, like, a thing that looked like a switch to flip, and if you flipped it, it made the, like, conveyor belt... Yeah. ...under you, like, go, but then that didn't go anywhere. Go back to near the start of the stage. There was a conveyor belt you couldn't mm -hmm. go up before. Yeah, I'm up here, and I'm just trying to figure out where to go from here after, the, like, the pentagon-looking grouping. Oh, there's just... You gotta go up. There's, um... I, I was I had to do that jump like a whole bunch of freaking times, uh, and I'm not even like a hundred percent sure how to explain it. But there should be like possibly a whip point. Hmm. Or a ledge climb point. Holy monkey cheese! <laughs> Dems, that's some giant eyeballs that came flying at me in the darkness. Yeah, we like, got it. Now I'm scared. Okay, I understand what to do. I almost made it that time. Oh, I, I really badly need some health. Oh, ah, there's a full health right there. That brain needs to die. Yo, there we go. Okay, I know what I was doing. And I think all you have to do to make that jump is not press anything after you whip. Yeah, that's what I have to Well, I'm chasing... I'm chasing Dr. Monkey for a head. <laughs> like, yeah. There we go. Okay, H, eight kernel directions time. Oh, I died. Oh, God. Go straight... Jim? Game over. Wow. There. Oh, was that all your continues? That apparently was, yeah. There is, if you want, I can give you... There's like level select codes. Oh, really? So you can just go back to that that level. Yeah, I guess I could do that. All right, give me a second here. Oh, green ba brains and pink brains and just brains everywhere. <gasps> a continue point. My prayers have been answered. Okay. Uh. I can look it up. I've got them right here. Okay. So just first get into the game. All right. So that you can pause it. And then pause the game. And then you'll hit these buttons in this order. Okay. R L A B B A L R. Groovy. Okay, cool. That'll take you to level five again. Sweet, thank you. Okay. Oh, nice come on, come on, come on, do it. Ah, oh, robot chicken. <laughs> of course. These uh, these whipping points. I'm I'm getting the first try, and I'm not pressing anything extra after pressing L or R. Okay. 
Oh, so this is Undertale now. <laughs> this is the internet. Everything is something else if we so say it. I don't know what's going on. Yo. But I'm fighting that robot chicken again. But this time we're falling down a pit. And I'm shooting it with my gun. Oh! Beat him! Oh, no. I'm all the way back here. <laughs> and the asteroids! Again. How's it going, Nick Rex? Oh, crap. I can't see the chats. That's not a good... <laughs> Not good. Come on. Not so much. Well, I've been uh, there I'm doing go. pretty good. <laughs> I must say, the last week has been like the, the last. 168 hours have been fantastic for me. That's a really oddly specific way to put that. <laughs> there, I can see the chats again. Hey! Oh, I earned a continue! Yo, what? Cool, I didn't even know that was a thing. Neither did I. For Pete's. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, this stage. This, that's this. Boy. This, um. This just turned into. Fun. Problems. You gotta be kidding me. Are you kidding me! Let go of Jim. That's a bad. No, no. Oh. I so buttoned, like, really hard. I, I buttoned so hard, you have no idea. <laughs> The buttons, though! Game! That's a good thing I just earned that continue, because holy crap, for Pete's sake, is that. Like, every Earthworm Jim. Well, I think Earthworm Jim's from B doesn't. But, oh my god, game one! <laughs> but, oh. Frick you. Really, game? Really? Alright, I am having some trouble here with the, uh, the series of whip-grabbing areas. What?! Game! Oh, this level is the worst thing. I was starting to say, so I'm like... All, like, three Earthworm Gym games that aren't Earthworm Gym 3D, there's a Pete level. 
Pete being just that pink dog that's like that hangs out with Jim. All right. You actually play it then? No. You have to. Oh my god, are you kidding me? You have to get either protect other puppies or in this the worst of all of them you have to protect what 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 you have to oh my god so pete's like walking along singing a song side by side with himself or some shit um and you have to get him to, like, the other end. It's an escort mission, of this. you're trying to say. Yeah, except you have to whip him to cause him to jump over pits. Oh. You have to attack enemies to get them out of the way. And if you screw anything up and he gets hurt, he attacks you and drags you back further. It's... Terrible. That does not sound fun. Yo, it's it. not even a little. They at least oh, I the game. they at least did the Pete stage in the second game was like way better. Uh, he would still get pissed off at you if you screwed up. And, like, attack you, but there was none of this dragging you backwards in the stage crap. Uh. Me dragging it out long. Oh my god, terrible! <laughs> also, when he, like, drags you backwards, it damages you. Oh, wow. So not only do you keep having your time wasted, but you will die eventually. That sounds less than fun. It's unbelievably fuck you game. <laughs> Holy crap. And guess what? There's these stupid UFO things that will frickin' uh, just go, go over to you and just like make you unable to move for a little bit. Oh wow. So that you can't, you know, actually do the thing. Are you kidding me, game? And I just died. I'm at 1% health. Okay. I'm at no this percent health. Is, <clears throat> this stage is the actual worst thing. I don't think I like level 5. <laughs> I don't know. I, I Level 5 is... Like, visually- OI! 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 GAME! WHY?! Level 5 is gonna look like a frickin' godsend when you get to For Pete's Sake. Like, if you get to this stage and you decide you don't want to keep trying, I will understand. I see. This game is just so full of shit right now. Level 5 is a good studio, true. Oh, this fuck level. Mmm. I, I can't not swear. This is like understandable. This is unreasonably stupid, and this was no better in the original game. It was absolutely in no way any better. Let's see. Can the stage just be over? I'm at the chicken. Okay. Oh, I screwed the pooch! Oh, <laughs> uh, you're gonna have to let Rowan, or Ropan, or her, whatever their name is supposed to be down, like, real hard. Because, like, 
they sound like they're excited because it's Earthworm Jim, and you need to let them down like real bad because it's Game Boy Advance Earthworm Jim. <laughs> What's up, Rowan? How's it going? At least the whip has a huge hitbox on these uh, targets. Like it can be off by a comparative half inch on an actual game. Oh, screen. this game is needs to suck. Sorry, I'm kidding. I'm, I'm just... It's okay. I put a language. Ah! It's fine. Nope. Oh, game can screw. This stage needs to be over. Thank you. I think. What? He's in his doghouse. This stage is over. <sighs> oh. The game should give you a continue for beating that stage at all, because that stage is the worst thing. Like, I will take every ice and water level <laughs> over that over that stage. That is bad. All right, Andy has Because if you, like, oh my gosh. Oh my pecking gosh. I just, ugh, that stage is so bad. <laughs> Oh. There's a there's just a point where it, things become unreasonably bad. Yeah. And it's annoying because it's still like playable, you know. Uh huh. It's functional. Can't complain about that. Yeah, but it's just like, oh, everything needs to stop. This level needs to just stop. <laughs> yeah. Because it's just so infuriating. The thing is, if you know, like every level, like any game, if you know what to do and when to do it. It would look like a total breeze. Mm -hmm. But oh. <laughs> like, you know, escort missions are never, almost never good. Yeah, on the best of days, an escort mission is merely good enough. Yeah, a mild annoyance. <laughs> Dark Souls really isn't even that hard. And it's actually a really forgiving game, which is part of why the difficulty actually works. Well, theoretically. I hear it's like Dark uh, Souls. Every I like how nobody can like just say that a game is hard anymore, and now it's always it's a comparison. It's like Dark Souls. Yeah, it has to be Dark Souls or some crap. Cuphead was the Dark Souls of something or another, and I'm like, man, if you people thought Cuphead was hard, I don't even know what to tell you anymore. <laughs> Cause, For yeah, sake, on hard I? mode that game's challenging, but on normal that game's just like an old school running gun. Which is ex literally what it is, granted. Looks like I'm, I think I'm exactly actually... one level behind you. Nice. Oh, I'm sorry, that means you're on. Yes. For Pete's sake. If you have a question about the stage, by all means. Thank you. I mean, not that I was like, even if we were racing, I'd still be like, do this. Because it's not like I'm gonna... What is the crap? Everyone. <laughs> See, that at least sounds like somebody came up with, like, a, a horribly amazing, like, trolley torture challenge. Exactly. This is just, like, the worst kind of escort mission ever. See, but that's just it. You you just admitted, like, we were doing it to, to come up with something terrible on purpose. This is just, we made an escort mission and then we ruined it. Like, we just made it bad. There's an, they were It was supposed to be good. It's supposed to be part of a good game, and they blew it. It's the... It's kind of the... 
the Mario Maker thing. Like, and you can't then, fault Mario Maker for the fact that people can make bad levels. You know, that's not Mario Maker's fault. People are going to make bad levels given the ability to make a bad level. Okay, well, I'll tell you what's They're not good, do it though, is these vines. Purpose. These tentacle vine things. These are not okay. Yeah, they're, they're pretty bad. I'm, I mean, what am I saying? That whole level is pretty bad. So far, it's not terrible, at least in my perspective. Oh, oh hello, asteroids. Carrie says Contra hard. Now, I remember back in the day, we used to call it Nintendo hard. <laughs> because a game being hard was like it was an NES game, because so many of them were so hard. Like Contra and Gradius and Ninja Gaiden. And many, many others. Sometimes for good reasons, like the games I just mentioned. Sometimes for terrible reasons, like Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde. Oh, heck. One of the most famously bad video games of all time. Ow! Wow, you actually have to time this whip. Like, just right. What the heck? Yeah, the, I'm, I'm not okay with this. This jump! What is with this jump? There are- there's some segments where you have to whip him, and then whip him again in mid-air oh. to complete the jump. It actually, here's the thing, you mentioned before, but like, the whip actually has a pretty good hitbox. Uh -huh. It does, and with the, with the dog, you, you kind of just need to figure out the spacing. Once you figure out the spacing, whipping is actually like the easiest part of right. uh, that stage. It's, uh, it's just that everything's going to get in the way of whipping. Of course. GAME! Oh my god. Yo, you woke up at 8 a.m.? Let's go. Congrats, dude. This stage has decided to also be Oh, it started jerk. me up here. Okay. Now I understand why. Yeah, fortunately, even if you use a continue, you actually start at your last, like, quote-unquote, checkpoint. Okay. The last spot that the dog that. would throw you back to. That's, like, the one forgiveness of that stage that makes it sufferable. I keep forgetting that yeah. I'm gonna die if I do that. <laughs> Nick, see, Nick Rex apparently, like, actually recognizes this as Escort Mission. <laughs> exactly. Just let all the noises out. You know you want to. <laughs> ah! Be all bad. Yeah, Rowan's got the jams on deck, though. All right, fine. I don't care. I'm doing it that way. I'm getting out of that stage because that's terrible. So, um, how long is this stage? Um, if you do decently, it's only like. don't know what you're doing, it's gonna feel way longer than it really should be. Right. I'm sure the speedrun takes like a minute on it. If that, like... No, I mean, he walks kind of slowly. I'm on some boss, I don't know what its name is. I don't even know what it is. I'm just whipping it a bunch, using all these iframes. I mean, let me, let me tell you something, Rowan. I found the entire Earthworm Gym collection 
online and just binge it over like a weekend. And I, I dug it so much. Oh, come on. Huh. Okay, beat that boss. Okay, you can whip and then hover. That's good to know. <laughs> Princess, what's her name? But nobody, nobody remembers the full name of Queen Slug for a butt. <laughs> she actually has this, like, ludicrously long, dis horrifyingly disgusting name. Yeah. Also, I'm in Buttville, which is the last stage. Oh, great. <laughs> and I'm dying real bad, real bad, real bad, real bad, everywhere, everywhere. Death, 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 doom. There we go. Oh. No. Jim. Jim, no! There we go. Alright, make a progress. Let's go. My, my suit went pop. Oh, I had to use a continue. Oh, boy. Oh, heck. This is... Alright, new checkpoint at least. I'm surprised that Pete didn't, didn't have anything to say about this game. Oh, okay. That just got me a bunch of extra lives, and I got out of there. Sweet. What am I doing? Please don't die. That's a cow. Oh, a tie back. That was a cow just flying by. Uh, maybe that was the first one, or Probably the one from the, the first cow. stage. You would. Oh. The enemy is anything to go by. It amuses me to death that you keep calling it an anime. American anime. Or, you know, a cartoon. American Last I checked. Yeah. You're right, though. <laughs> just let me whip the that's thing. Just, that's just generally the, the difference in nomenclature that we use. Yeah. There. America cartoon. Where am I going? Places. Why are these UFOs in literally the worst place? Always. Because it's that stage. And there's no way to mash out of there. Fiddle faddle again. I I don't even have like Argh cannot properly express your rage. I can't. Oh there we go. Okay. 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 Where am I going? Down. Ow. We're going all the way please, back. Let's go. Please stop killing me. Frog why is there an evil frog? Why not? There are evil frogs in this stage. You should be chastising them. They're, I mean, they're frog, right? They're yours or something. <laughs> Dang it! I don't necessarily live and breed frog. I just participate <laughs> in the frog highly. What is this? This is not <laughs> Participate in a frog. <laughs> yeah. He's in the worst possible place. Every time. There we go. Okay. We're gonna... We're gonna do it. Can these frogs not go? That is... bad. I just... no. That's bad, game. I only Don't lost because you were in my controller. Thanks, John Dot. <laughs> <laughs> like those quotes are those actual things that were said um no these at some point 
these are automatically generated. Um, like, I only lost because X, Y. That's the formula. That's- Oh, game, don't do it that! Okay. We got- I hit a continue point. That's good. Can these UFOs just stop? <laughs> uh -huh. Uh -huh. Yeah! Yeah! <laughs> I know, right? And also, can I stop missing? My foot pedals were in another castle. That's a good one. I was just, I thought maybe those were actual quotes. I was gonna say, man, you guys are like as good as Ronaldo and I are when we do Super Game Friends. <laughs> one of my favorite titles is, um. <laughs> the sun was in my man! <laughs> I remember that one. Imagine if you didn't have hips! That would suck! <laughs> That's a good one. What the heck? Why'd you go backward? Oh. I it went backward. Oh god, okay, so. Remember that, uh. whipping whip points you were, like, praising? Yeah. <laughs> well, here's a part where you have to whip, and then turn around, whip in the other direction, to catch another, higher up, thing. <gasps> I did it! And you have to do that like four times in a row. Oh, that's fun. Ooh, so is that. Oh good, only back here. Okay, hit another checkpoint, that's good. Not even like. I'm not interested in losing all of my life and continues, however. That is something that I wish not to happen. <gasps> Continue point! <sighs> oh. I feel the power of the universe pushing me forward. Is this it? Oh, we're on some kind of boss. Alright, I'm dead. Okay, I can do this. I believe in you, winner. Thank you. I don't think I believe in myself, but... We'll see how it goes, I guess. Ah! sound of this dog will forever haunt me. <laughs> what the heck? Continue point! The sides of the th graphics are like, I don't know if those graphics are supposed to be screwing up or not. <laughs> like, I'm not 100% sure. I hear typing. Earthworm Jim, GBA stage select. Oh, ha ha ha! Oh no! Where am I going? What is this platform? I actually still have the codes in front of me, by the way. Okay. What stage were you on? You were in on for Pete's sake. Yeah. Oh, this is easy too. Okay, so you paused? Yeah. R L R L A R. Alright. Groovy? <laughs> did, did it work? I did it backward. Oh. Did you did you get it? Uh, not working. Um Somebody clip that? On my screen, please? Because that's both hilarious and really bad. Jim is gone. The camera is following a platform I was standing on while I have 3% health, don't exist, and am constantly making a taking damage noise. <laughs> nice. Hey. 
And... No. No. The game soft locked. Oh. This is when I wish this all the stages had timers. Yeah. So that the timer could time out and I could go back to the checkpoint. I I am so mad right now. Yeah, the Pete's sake code is not working. So R L R L A R? Yeah. Tried it about eight times. So I'm just gonna play through whatever this uh, anti asteroids thing is. I just got to. Uh, I, I punched in the level select code that's on Game Facts. So I'm just gonna hope I can get through this. I really don't want to play this whole stage over from the beginning. I really, really don't. We're getting a lot of, like, once and done stages here, aren't we? I guess I'm starting that stage from the beginning. Let's see if a different code works. Pete's sake seems to be the only code that doesn't work here. Ruby. All right, I've entered the level select code to go to Buttville. So now I'm at Buttville. Here we go again. I decided Here we to go all the over again. Oh my God, Joe. Jim, Jim! I almost called you Joe. <laughs> Jim. Jam. <laughs> I don't even know. Please stop dying. I've made the executive decision in the interest of time to just skip the butt bill. Since the uh, code doesn't seem to be working anyway. You cheaty cheaterson. I know, right? It's just, just cheating all over the place. Turn into a frickin' opera singer or whatever. Oh, cow! Well, it's easier to deal with if you actually helicopter down, it seems. That's the point. Codes. They anger me. <laughs> yes, er, his name is now Earthworm. Jo Earthwim. Earth. <laughs> his name is now Earthwim Johan. <laughs> That's it. That's the next game. Earthwim Johan. That works for me.
Where, where, where in the heck? Where in the heck am I going? I wouldn't doubt where, that. Where, where, where in the heck? Okay. I, I beat for Pete's sake earlier, Rohan. Oh, here's this spot. Ah, fiddle faddle! Nope! Ah, you flitch the blip! Fuck poo! <laughs> I can't even deal with any of this! <laughs> Thank you for the codes. <laughs> what are the odds? We found the one person. The one person who did it. No! Fiddle faddle again! I need other foods that kind of sound like funny swear words. <laughs> ah! This is destroying my thumb. This this one part, this one part where you have to whip up the the thing I was talking about. Yeah, I'm there right now. Oh, this is no. Yeah, this is not okay. No, why? Mm. Okay. Uh, <laughs> gotta gotta shake those hands out. Gotta. Oh my god. I'm gonna have a callus on this thumb like real bad. Why did the? F why? 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 Jim! <gasps> Got it! Okay. Nice. Just, just go. Jump. Helicopter. Jump. Continue. Oh! More gun. More gun, Freeman. <laughs> oh, that was pretty good. Definitely gonna die. Yep, there I go. There I went. There I gint. Man, I managed to cheap this out a moment ago. Okay. Okay. Well, now I have full health for this mid boss or whatever it is. There we go. Alright, I think I have the timing down. Nice. Twice in a row. Thrice in a row. Nice. Okay, made it. Ayo! Yeah, I got this. <laughs> I believe in the me that believes in myself. Or whatever. Continue. The, the, the line is believe in the me that believes in you. Yeah, there we go. But, like, somebody else has to say it to you. <laughs> right. <laughs> It, it, yeah, it doesn't work as a, like... Oh, thank you very okay. much for the follow I'm at that point where I... Fiddle, faddle! Uh... Alrighty, Sirix, so I'll see you around. Alright, Matt, see you, man. Thank you so much for the follow once my... again. That's my buddy, Madamus. I blew <laughs> that's his whole name. <laughs> you have to say it like that from now on to be respectful. <laughs> okay, so where am I going here? Shh. 
Shibbity do what? Shibbity a. My oh my. What a shibbity day. <laughs> Don't believe in yourself. Don't even believe in the me that believes in you. Believe in the frog car that believes in all of us. Thanks, Rowan. Truly inspired words. I actually don't know what to do now. I only lost because the sun was dealing with emotional issues. I just beat the game. Yo, really? I guess. That... Except the boss isn't Evil Queen Slug for a butt, I think. Huh. I don't think it was her already. Oh, no! And then Princess What's-Her-Name got smushed by a cow! So, yeah, I'm stuck. I'm stuck here. <laughs> I don't know what, what I'm doing. And then she and the cow fell in the lava and Jim stole her crown. <laughs> nice. That is some lore. Earthwim Joanne, copyright 2001, Interplay Entertainment Core. <laughs> Converted for Majesco sales by Game Titan Inc. something else, Game Titan Team things, whatever. Etc. Sheenen Crew. We just want to shout out to them since we played two of their games tonight, apparently. Yeah. Well, I mean, At least this isn't... what they work on the sound for. And I'll tell you, the, their sound make, actually makes for some good jams. Yo, JK and Sal, what is that? <laughs> it's like, this This area was designed around glitches. That, that area is, like, definitely glitchy. What is this end screen shot? It's like that one Queen song, but it's like three of the devs and Earthworm Jim. <laughs> what? I'm not even kidding. Okay, what? Okay. And that's it. And then we just go right back to the bumper screens and back to the title screen. <laughs> that's... There we go. That was Earthworm Jim for the Game Boy freaking advance. Nice. Holy crap, that was a mess. <laughs> well, congrats on That the... was a messy... Congrats on that was a messy mess. Oh. Oh, it, that, I... I re 